Hello students, welcome to our channel Learning Notebook. It is always fun to learn maths through activities. So today in this video, we are going to learn addition of three digit and four digit numbers with the help of an activity. But before starting with this activity, let me tell you that we have many more maths art integrated activities, projects and working models on our channel Learning Notebook. You can find the list of all of them on our website as well. The link to our website is below in the description box. For this activity, we need few colorful thick sheets, a ruler, a black marker pen, a pencil and a pair of scissors. Aim of this art integrated project is to Learn addition of three digit numbers and four digit numbers with the help of an activity. If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. Students, we have a separate video on complete chapter of addition for class 3. I am sure all your doubts related to addition would be resolved after watching this comprehensive video. The link to this video is here on the top. Now, let's start with the activity. In the first step, take a red sheet of paper and draw small circles on it as shown here. And then, carefully cut out these circles using pair of Scissors. In the second step, take a green colored sheet and draw small rectangles on it. And then carefully cut these rectangles using pair of scissors. In the same way, we have to cut out small squares from a blue colored sheet. And also some small triangles from an orange colored sheet. Students, we have a very interesting math project to understand the concept of odd and even numbers. So I would recommend you to watch this video. The link to this video is here on the top. So students, we have cut out red circles which represent one's place. Rectangles which represent tens place. Similarly, we have cut out squares to represent hundred place and triangles to represent thousand place. So this means 10 red circles equals to 1 green rectangle because 10 ones equals to 1 10. Similarly, 10 green rectangles equals to 1 blue square because 10 tens equals to 100. In the same way, 10 blue squares equals to 1 triangle because 10 hundreds equals to 1000. If you want to learn more about place values, then I would recommend you to watch our video Paper Abacus. The link to this video is here on the top. Now let's see how to add three digit numbers with this activity. The numbers are 542 and 136. Now take one A3 sheet and divide it into three columns and four rows. Give the heading as 
ones, tens, and hundred. Now the first number is five hundred forty-two. Where two is at ones place, four is at tens place, and five is at hundred place. So first is two ones. So let's put two red circles here. Next is four tens. So let's put four green rectangles here. And then there is five hundred. Let's put five blue squares. Now the next number is one hundred thirty-six, where six is at ones place, three is at tens place, and one is at hundred place. So first is six ones. So let's put six red circles here. Next is three tens. So put three green rectangles, and then we have one hundred. So let's put one blue square. Now first add the ones place. For this, add these red circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's write eight here. Then we will add the tens place. So let's count these green rectangles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's write seven. And then we will add the hundred place. For this, count these blue squares. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's write six. So our answer is six seven eight or six hundred seventy eight. Students, if you want to learn about different types of shapes through interesting activities, then do watch our both these videos. I'm sure you would love these creative activities. The link to both these videos are here on the top. Now let's add another three digit numbers which are 456 and 244. So let's write the heading once again as ones, tens and hundred. First number is 456. Where six is at ones place, five is at tens place, and four is at hundred place. Now first is six ones. So let's put six red circles here. Next is five tens. So let's put. Five green rectangles here, and then there is four hundred. So let's put four blue squares. Next number which we have to add is two hundred forty-four, where four is at ones place. Next four is at tens place. And two is at hundred place. So first is four ones. So let's put four red circles. Next we have four tens. So let's put four green rectangles. And then we have two hundred. So let's put two blue squares. Now, students, let's first add ones place. For this, we will count the red circles. Here we have 
six circles. So let's count further. Seven, eight, nine, ten. But we cannot write two digits here. And I told you that ten ones equals to one tens. So we will carry one to the tens place. Next, let's add tens place. Here we have five rectangles. So let's count further: six, seven, eight, nine, and one carry, which is equals to ten. But again. We cannot write two digits here, and I told you that ten tens equals to one hundred. So we will carry one to the hundreds place. Next, we will add hundreds place. Here we have four squares. So let's count further: five, six. And one carry, which is equals to seven. So our answer is seven zero zero or seven hundred. Students, we have a very interesting working model to understand and learn place value and place value chart. I'm sure you would love this video. The link to this video is here on the top and in the description box. Now let's add four digit numbers with this activity. Numbers are five zero two one and four one zero three. Now here, along with ones, tens, hundred, we have another place called thousand. So first number is five zero two one, where one is at ones place, two is at tens place, zero is at hundred place, and five is at thousand place. So first is one ones. So let's put one red circle. Next is two tens. So let's put two green rectangles. Third is zero hundred. So we will not put anything here. And then there is five thousand. So let's put five triangles here. Now the next number is four one zero three, where three is at ones place. Zero is at tens place, one is at hundred place, and four is at thousand place. So first is three ones. So let's put three red circles. Next is zero tens. So we will not put anything here. Then one hundred. So put one blue square. And last is four thousand. So put. Four triangles here. Now let's first add ones place. For this, count the red circles. Here we have three circles, so three plus one circle equals to four. Next, count the green rectangles, which are only two. So write two, and then. At hundreds place, there is only one blue square, so write one. And now we will add thousand place. For this, we will count these triangles. Here we have five triangles, so let's count further: six, seven, eight, nine. So write nine. So our answer is nine one two four or Nine thousand one hundred twenty-four. Students, we have another working model to understand and learn 
place value and expanded form the link to this video is here on the top and in the description box now let's do one more addition of four digit numbers the numbers are 3510 and 1541 so first number is 3510 where 0 is at 1's place, 1 is at 10's place, 5 is at 100th place and 3 is at 1000th place. So first is 0 1's. So we will not put anything here. Next is 1 10's. So let's put 1 green rectangle. Then 500. So put 5 blue squares. Last is 3000. So put 3 triangles here. Now the next number is 1541 where 1 is at 1's place, 4 is at 10's place, 5 is at 100th place and 1 is at 1000th place. So let's first put one red circle at one's place, then four green rectangles at tens place, next five blue squares at hundred place, and one triangle at thousand place. Now let's first add one's place. For this, we will count the red circles, which is only 1. So, write 1. Next, count green rectangles. Here, we have 4 green rectangles. So, let's count further. 4 plus 1 rectangle equals to 5. Next, let's add hundreds place. For this, count these blue squares. Here, we have 5 squares. So, let's count further. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. But students, we cannot write 2 digits here. And we know 10 hundred equals to 1000. So, let's carry 1 to the thousand place. Now let's add thousand place. Here we have three triangles. So let's count further. Three triangles plus one triangle equals to four. Plus one carry equals to five. So our answer is five zero five one or five thousand. 51. So this is the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed this activity. Please share my channel and my videos further. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye bye.